it's not decent to sit opposite 88 year old global icon. Labour Party's Baba Ahmed rejects showing cards call for public debate. This is getting more tougher, Nigerians. Baba Ahmed, in a statement on Saturday by the Obidati Media Office, said he could not take up Shankar's offer of a public debate due to political and cultural reasons. Hey guys, welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for this coming out here. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe and don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you. The Vice Presidential Candidate of the Labour Party, Yusuf Darty Baba Ahmed has rejected the challenge to a public debate with Nobel laureate Professor Oloshenka. Baba Ahmed, in a statement on Saturday by the Obidati Media Office, said he could not take up Shenka's offer a public debate due to political and cultural reasons. Baba Ahmed was under fire over his comment on China's television last month that it would be undemocratic to swear in Ahmed Bola Tinubu as Nigerian's president come 29th May 2023. In reaction to Baba Ahmed's comment, Shane Kari, in a statement titled Fascism on Curse, described Baba Ahmed's statement as fascist. He then challenged Baba Ahmed to a debate. Baba Ahmed's statement reads partly, therefore, we state that the Labour Party's vice presidential candidate, Dr. Yusuf Dati Baba Ahmed, cannot take up Professor Sheinka's offer of a public debate, not out of cowardness, but for cultural and political reasons. Culturally, it is just not decent. Their age and accomplishment gaps taken into account for Darty to sit opposite the 88-year-old global icon and point out his folly to his face, even if the older man called for it. And politically, there is no base for such a challenge because Professor is not on the opposition by a lot. Hey guys, what's your take on this? The vice presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Yusuf Dati Baba Ahmed, has rejected the challenge to a public debate with Nobel laureate Professor Uloshenka. Baba Ahmed, in a statement on Saturday by the Ubidati Media Office, said, he could not take up Shankar's offer of a public debate due to political and cultural reasons. Baba Ahmed was under fire over his comment on China's television last month that it would be undemocratic to swear in Ahmed Bolar Tinubu as Nigerian's president come May 29, 2023. In reaction to Baba Ahmed's comment, Shenka, in a statement titled Fascism or Cause, described Baba Ahmed's statement as fascist. He therefore challenged Baba Ahmed to a debate. Baba Ahmed's statement reads partly. Therefore, we state that the Labour Party's vice presidential candidate, Dr. Yusuf Darty Baba Ahmed, cannot take up Professor Shenka's offer of a public debate, not out of cowardness, but for a cultural and political reasons. Culturally, it is just not decent. Their age and accomplishments gaps taken into account. For that, it will sit opposite the 88-year-old global icon and point out is fully to his face, even if the older man called for it. And politically, there is no basis for such a challenge because Professor is not on the opposite ballot. And these have got Nigerians talking. Him sitting opposite Bart in a debate would be more ideal. 
both of them will, sh will sure tell us more about democracy. Wisdom is known to be part of obedience. Best answer, Nigerians should be great again. This man read a lot of wisdom in part books. Shame cannot get shame. Where him they worry with his precious wire results, he rule him as a president. My vice president has so much upstairs. Give us your preferred candidate, Darty Barbara Ahmed, ever ready to debate with him. This advice must be directly from Peter Obi. Let 88 year old professor retire in politics before Peter Obi address him as my respected elder brother. Sheinka should respect himself. Well, Sheinka, sir, I only have to tell you that knowledge is different from wisdom. I hope you understand. When you belong, when the state of our country is at hand. Oga, you must go. That must attend. Let these people lead Nigeria and see challenge. I can't mis misinterpret these statements. He earned respect from me. This is called strategy, strategic approach. Why did Baba no debate Tinubu? Why he won't debate that of what value? Is the debate. Election don't pass. It for better if he arranged the debate with all of them before election. I have always thought Baba has a soft spot for Awolo Eke. Okay, guys, these are reactions by Nigerians. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please do not forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not. Thank you. Police coming out here. Bye for now.